And here we are. We have uh, back with us again. Thank you for being back on another great episode of the Veterans Ranch Show. We have Christine Dean here with us. Uh, been working with Christine for over a couple of years now. An absolutely amazing person to deal with. A heart bigger than this screen. Uh, true passionate patriot. Brings a wealth of knowledge and experience to everything she does. Christine is a former mill spouse. She's going to talk about that. And she is also currently a Blue Star mom. So again, needless to say, she understands a lot about military life in general from uh, really both sides of the coin. So without further ado, let's bring her in here. Christine, welcome to the Veterans Ranch Show. Thank you, JR. I always enjoy spending time with you. <laughs> we, tend to, we tend to spend a lot together. We kiddingly, you know, well, we won't talk about that joke, but... <laughs> Tell us, tell us more. I mean, I know I, I tried to give a resounding introduction there for you, but why don't you tell you us uh, more? Do. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, tell us, tell us more about, you know, who you are and, and uh, just kind of what's brought you to this point. Oh, goodness. That's a really long story. How much time do we have? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, JR, I mean, do you want me to start from the beginning? When I was born, <laughs> we don't right. want to go back that When far. I was knee high to the guys, hop off. Yes. <laughs> no, let's let's kind of talk about you know let's let's really kind of get into yourself your your mill spouse right how you how you yeah. got into being involved with the military and and uh, you know let's just kind of move forward let's say past high school and let's move forward. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad to see we survived high school, right? Yeah, for me, I know. Um, gosh, um, when I was married, um, and my husband was in the Navy, and so way back when brush the dust off there yeah mill spouse thing right um but i was familiar with the military already my grandfather was um well we can't say was you never say former marine they're always a marine but um god rest his soul he passed away and i miss him but you know he was a marine and i have to tell you the family patriotism you got to understand you know even when he was getting older and he couldn't remember anything and and he was having problems and, and trying to remember things you know he'd be in his 80s and and he still had his his hat on right his military veteran hat on right for the the marines so you always knew that he was a marine and he'd be in the hospital and he'd say christine i need to get me out of here go get my m1 get me my tennis shoes we're out of here <laughs> so from way back when i i always remember him being really proud of, of being a marine and and that was a huge part of his younger life and so that patriotism just kind of continued throughout my life so when i married my first husband and uh, he was in the navy i was like oh okay that makes sense it, it, you know i want to be supportive um we did the the moving multiple locations um every time you move you don't know anybody uh, you kind of have to make new friends wherever you go and um, we were lucky we didn't go anywhere really far at one point i thought we were going to end up overseas in guam but that didn't happen i was kind of grateful we were stateside but now thinking back on it you know a little extra excitement might not have been a bad thing um but when I got pregnant with my oldest son, um, he was out to sea and I couldn't just tell him. So the struggles of a, you know, blue star, um, you know, as my son's in now. I, so just the military lifestyle has been an ongoing thing for me. Um, I remember I had to, I couldn't call him and tell him, hey, guess what? We're pregnant, right? I had to actually send him a little baby bottle and inside I wrote the word June. And I mailed that to him. And all of a sudden I get this really scratchy, you know, ship to shore phone. Great. And they're coming through. Is it true? Are we having a baby? Yes, we are. Right. Um, so it's, it's interesting, the challenges as opposed to now, right? My son's active duty Air Force and, you know, he might be in one of those sandy places, but he can still FaceTime me. You know, what a different lifestyle it's changed into um, with the access with the military. But I've always been just a passionate patriot. It's It's been a, a part of my life for as long as I can remember. And so when my son had said, Mom, I want to join the service, I was like, heck, yeah, go for it, baby. You know, I was telling him, do everything while you're um, young and dumb. And I'm like, see the world. Go everywhere. Do it now before you're married and have kids and just go have a blast and, you know, great experience. You learn so much. So yeah, he's having a lot of fun in the Air Force. And, and then my, my good friend said, hey, you know, um, we've got this DFW Veterans Chamber of Commerce. And I said, 
what? And she's like, I need you to help. I'm like, okay. Next thing you know, I'm on board with that. I'm on the board of directors there. I'm um, having a great time playing in the veteran space. It's so wonderful to be able to continue to give back to that community. And then I stumble into JR. I'm a big guy to stumble into, right? <laughs> Six, four, two, sixty. I'm a big guy to stumble into. Let's let's do this. We're going to do it a little early, but I got some more stuff I want to cover. Let's let's do a quick commercial break, and then we'll we'll get in into uh, uh, the chamber and uh, a little bit led you up to that point. Uh, folks, today we want to talk about Infone. Infone is the business tool pad uh, that is such an awesome thing to have to stay connected with everyone. It is your digital business card that allows you to share so much more than what you can put on a card, right? You get somebody's business card and it's got 10,000 things, looks like ants crawling across the back of it. You're not hanging on to that card. You want something that is memorable. You need to reach out to our friends at Enphone. Folks, we use it, here it is right here. So reach out to my buddy, Steve Ramona today at info.co forward slash SR1. That is info.co forward slash SR1. Reach out to Steve today for more info. You won't regret it and we'll be right back. <laughs> 